In this video, I'm going to show you how to locate and download Landsat TM images and open them in an open source free GIS package called Quantum GIS. The first step is to find the Globus website using uh, Google, or you can just enter in the website address usgs.globus.gov. Once you get to the site, you're going to locate your the, the appropriate Landsat image using the map in the upper left hand corner and you can just click it's a very crude rough map but you can click in the general region of where you're looking for and then from there to find the exact Landsat image you can zoom in a little bit more and then overlay towns and uh, government borders and roads Once you've found the appropriate TM image, um, you can filter by specifically under Landsat TM. And once you've found the image that you want, you can scroll through different years and months. Uh, you can adjust the cloud cover. You can tell it to only show images with 10 or 20% cloud cover. And then you're going to download that image. Uh, you first need to create a login address. It's free to do this on the USGS site. Um, and this will allow you to download the images. And once you've uh, added that to your shopping cart, you click the little download icon. And it's going to give you four different options. And in this exercise, we're looking at downloading Landsat Look images. And these are geo-referenced images. So they can, when you pull them into a GIS package, they'll appear where they should appear. In, in geographic space. And it's going to give you a number of files, both um, uh, files that have the geocoding and also image files. And you're going to need to uncompress that using a, a PKN zip or WinZip or some freely available zip software. And zip all those, unzip all those files into its own separate folder. good to give it a name somewhat similar so you know which date the images are from. And once you've got that uh, unzipped into its own folder, you can open Quantum GIS and you hit on the uh, Add Raster Image layer. Locate the folder where you unzip the files. and then select one of the image files downloaded from uh, Globus. And it's going to give you two different images. The first one we're loading here is a infrared image, which isn't very helpful um, or hard to, to uh, decipher. But if you want to get the more natural color image, you can grab that also and overlay it right over it. Now the beauty of having it in a GIS package is you can overlay that with other bound like uh, other layers like boundary layers or roads, towns, um, parcels. So here I'm going to overlay a, a boundary layer for the Pine Ridge Indian Reservation. And this is a layer I got off the Census uh, Tiger website, which has boundary files for all reservations in the United States. So here I'm loading in that boundary layer, and I'm going to make it so it's transparent, but you can still see the edges. I'm just going to tell it to turn off the fill. And there you have it, a Landsat image viewed in Quantum GIS, uh, completely free open source software package. Thank you.